going to cover some of the safety procedures today on the grain bin. And what the first thing we want to do is whenever we get this bin full of grain, we want to close the inner doors. We want to go ahead and close the latch on the door and we want to go ahead and put the lock in. And once we have the lock in place, and the reason for the lock is we don't want anybody to enter the bin while the machine is running. We want to go ahead and make sure that the lock is locked here. The system comes with two locks whenever it's ordered. There's one for the access door on the bottom, and there's one for the manhole on the top of the bin. And we want to make sure that both of those locks are in place, that somebody cannot get in the bin while the machine is running. The next step we want to cover is we want to make sure uh, we use our lockout tagout procedures. And what that is, is we come over here to the main power box. We want to disengage the power. We want to put the lock into the disconnect handle on the power box. That way nobody can get into the bin or have access to the power of the bin while the machine is being serviced. And the only one that has this key is the man that put the lock on the outside box. We want to make sure that he puts that lock in his pocket. That way nobody has access to come and turn the power on to the machine while he's in the bin doing service work. One of the things we want to cover on the service side of it is we want to look at the jaw clutch and the belts and pulleys on the drive unit. We want to make sure that the belts are all in good shape. We want to make sure that the pulley's in good shape, make sure there is no excessive wear on it. The jaw clutch, we want to make sure it's free and moves in and out. No wearing on the jaws of the clutch itself. We want to make sure that the belt tightener, everything is lined up and in good shape. Make sure it's tight. Make sure there isn't any wear, any play in the bully, on the pulley itself and the bearings. Uh, we just want to make sure that everything works free. We want to make sure that the belt guard is in good shape. We want to make sure whenever we're done doing service on this that we put the belt guard back in place. That way nobody can come in contact with the belts as they're running while the machine is running. We also send a set of decals with every uh, system that we have. We have some for the power box. We have some for the equipment. We have some pretty well everywhere through the bin. We have entrapment stickers that go on the inside of the bin. We just want to make sure they're all in place. A safety decal does not prevent you from getting in the bin, but it reminds you not to get in the bin.